you know, I get this same question a lot about a program I have called Mass Made Simple. Mass Made Simple is a bus bench program. You do what I tell you to do. You do it for six weeks. Uh, six weeks in one day, you evaluate how it went, and then you can give me feedback. If you didn't gain mass, come on out here, punch me in the face. I'm happy if you followed it. But what happens is I'll get a I'll get an email, Dan, I don't have a bench press. Can I substitute bench pressing for push-ups? No. Uh, I don't feel like doing the complexes. Can I do something else? Well, no, because then it's not mass made simple. And the big one is squats hurt my knees or I've got a bad back, so I can't do the squat program. And I know this sounds harsh and mean, but then that's not mass made simple. And I can't guarantee it's going to work. I can't even tell you how it's going to work. Uh, there's someone on Amazon critiqued it and said, well, there's no leg presses and all professional bodybuilders do leg presses. Well, yeah, and all professional bodybuilders shoot up with this, this, and this. But you, you see, so this is a, you, it's apples and oranges. They're two different things. So as much as I would like to say, oh yeah, make any substitutions you want, when it comes to a bus bench program where you're expecting results in a short amount of time, there are no substitutes. And that's a hard lesson to learn. Uh, Dan, I want to do your Olympic lifting program called Big 21 in the bench press. Will it work? Well, you know, it might work, but you've substituted it out. So I don't know. No one's ever done it. You now are uh, N equals one, as we now say, you're by yourself. Uh, I don't mean to be cruel, and I get in the year 2019 and coming up to 2020 at warp speed that, you know, everybody, you know, everybody's special, everybody's an individual, everybody's changeable. But in my world of, of training and lifting weights, strength and conditioning, this is where you get into trouble, is you take a program and you start to pull the things out, and then the program falls apart. And then you come back and you say, well, what was it that I did? My answer is always, we didn't follow the program. Uh, it is a gift in a lot of ways. And it's too bad because when I first started on computers, computers were a lot less friendly. But I tell you one thing it taught you. It taught you discipline. Uh, when I first went online, I had to learn, I believe it was called HTML code. And you had to have this thing and this thing. And if you didn't put B slash, Everything for 5,000 pages was in bold. And so you had to go back and find where you forgot to put that in. Very unforgiving. Now, if you go to a place like WordPress, you can highlight the whole area and press B, and it looks perfect. Mass made simple bus bench programs are 1998 HTML codes. It's, they're very unforgiving. They have to be done exactly. But now it's 2019, 20 years later, and the computer and WordPress and the websites are all very friendly. The problem is this. Those friendly programs, that's Park Bench. The tough ones, the six-week, three-week, two-week programs, those are Bus Bench, and you can't change anything on them. I'm not a bad person. I'm just telling you the truth.